I'm here with Yalen, aka The Fuglo on Instagram, and today we're gonna be making red Thai curry, kind of just our style. So I'm gonna show you all that we have. Alrighty, so we have everything laid out, all the pots and pans that we need. Um, we're gonna start off by making the rice. So online it says that for every one cup of rice, it's two cups of water, but I like my rice a little bit more sticky. So we're gonna do one cup of rice, one cup of coconut milk, and half a cup of water. So as the water and the coconut milk is boiling, I'm gonna start cutting up the chicken so that it's ready for whenever we're ready to cook. Got no lies, got no flex, I got steam. Got that fire that be burning in my sleeve. Got that girl who keep peeking through my dreams. So guys, we just added the rice to the boiling water. So we're just gonna let that cook down. Um, for about like 20 minutes? Yeah, 20, 20 minutes or yeah. so. We're gonna start cooking the vegetables. Put your stove to between four and medium. Throw a little bit of oil in there. Um, that should be good. And then, so that the vegetables simmer in the curry sauce, we're gonna add both curry sauces. So from Trader Joe's, I got Thai red curry sauce. And then this is from Lucky's. It's another red curry sauce. Alrighty, mix that up, and then when that's heating up, add all of your vegetables. You're gonna add garbanzo beans, bamboo shoots, and peas. To the vegetables, add a little bit of curry powder, add a little bit of cayenne pepper. To your liking, don't add too much so that later on you can taste it, because you can always add more, but you can't take stuff out. Add a little bit of ground turmeric. So now we're adding half a cup of peas to the veggies. We added the peppers, and we're just gonna let it simmer now. So it's on a medium heat, and we're just gonna lower it to simmer while we let the chicken cook. All right, guys, so it's time to add the sauce and all the powder and all that, so I'm gonna show you. So the chicken's not quite done, but it's time. So from Trader Joe's, oh, uh, nope, this one. From Trader Joe's, it's just a regular red Thai curry sauce. And then from Lucky's to the mixture, you're gonna add some curry powder for some extra flavor. Cayenne pepper, but don't add too much because you can always taste it later. And some turmeric. And then I'm just gonna mix that all up. Then I'm gonna lower the heat to maybe like a two to just let it simmer in that sauce. The rice is done, it's perfect consistency. There's no more water that's absorbing. What's up J plus three family? How are you guys doing today? So I'm just gonna quickly add the chicken to the vegetables. And then to finish everything off, I'm just gonna throw some paprika in there. Okay guys, so we just finished plating everything. I'm about to show you what it looks like. All I want was Cory and Topanga. All that lovey. Ah. Uh. Alrighty, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Austin just didn't mean to do anything. He just wants to close out the video. So the recipe will be in the description below. She's gonna explain her Instagram. Yes, guys. So follow my food blog. It's on Instagram. It's at the Food Glow. So if you don't live in Florida and you plan on visiting it, Yalen has the reviews. She has the ratings. Give her a hit her in the DMs on the gram. I'm sure yes. she'll get back to you. Hit me up. I love when you guys ask me questions. If you want to submit recommendations, I don't mind that too. I actually love that. All right. Our SMS of the day goes to, I want to say Sarah E. Bain 33, or is it Sarai? I'm not sure, but I'm going to put it right here. Thank you so much for watching and supporting us. We appreciate it. Yeah. Bye. 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 Bye.